How the hell do you get your songs into Beat Saber after creating them in Mediocre Mapper? Well, that's today's tutorial, kids. Pull up your Mediocre Mapper. I will link you the website. Um, this is the mapper you'll be using currently. And uh, this is the .zip file. Bing, ba bing. And then you make it. And when this comes up, the first thing you're going to want to do is enter your Beat Saber install folder. So pull up your folder, pull up your Beat Saber, grab the URL, copy, pasta. Thanks, let me map now. Uh, cool. So, things to worry about over here. Bongo Cat. That's the best. Cat. That's also the best. Leave it. Um, if you ever want to go six lane mode, precision placement, any of these, song loader extra fields, you hit it with the check mark and then whenever you're creating a song and let's create songs and work in progress songs make beat song first name it don't just click it new test song make it this and what happens is you want to if you want to enable all those things here in extra fields and in requirements you put mapping extensions ba -ding. Okay, easy peasy. That's how you do like six lane. That's how you do precision placement. That's how you do precision rotation. Rotation. And you can turn them all on over here. Um, all this stuff, who cares? Great. Work in progress songs. This. You know, you know what? Let's just do it like this. This is the song. <laughs> Here's the artist. Here is your name. Uh, BPM, find this online for whatever song you're using. Uh, cover image name, you want to get a maybe, you know, 256 by 256. Make sure you name the extension correctly whenever you place it in the folder. Default environment, you can pick whichever one you want. Custom platform, I don't know how to use that. So you're, you're, uh, you're on your own. But uh, back in here, let's go to work in progress songs. Here's the new test song that you've just created in your Beat Saber folder. It'll have it info.json. And when you put an image in here, say uh, cover art. Look for one that has, you know, uh, 1345 by 1345. It's a square. So that's the kind of thing you want to get. Um, and then you just name it whatever you want. You go to your Beat Saber folder, your work in progress songs, and you save it. So easy. See? See how easy it is, people? How beautiful. Uh, Square.jpg. Cool. That should, that should do it. Cover image not found. What are you doing? Where did I put it? Oh, see? Yeah, see? You'll make mistakes if you don't watch out. <laughs> Square.jpg. Peachy. Um, okay. Oh! There's a nice button here. Oh. What? Huh? Okay. Um, then you go over here. Add your first difficulty. Pick whichever one you want. Um, you can change it down here. So here's your difficulty. Say you want to go expert, characteristic. Uh, oh, no arrow, single saber. Okay, so you can go ahead and place that in there to begin with. Difficulty label. Benny workout. That's my uh, favorite difficulty there. Audio file name, song.ogg. So what you want to do, and I'll go through this quick bit of tutorial. Um, Grab your song, drop it in there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. And then we want to check the BPM. Uh, huh? All right, let's do that. Just in case, I'll open a few. 116. 116. So, tracks, add a new track, mono track down below. Make sure you click in it. 
and then you generate a rhythm track. Change your tempo BPM to 116 beats per bar. Let's leave four and number of bars, just do 100. That should be safe. Yeah, 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 yeah. That is way off, but what we can do is just adjust. And that looks kind of close. Those lines are looking okay. You know what? That looks good to me. So take this um, distance right here at the start and go look down here, 0.243. And then you plug it in to start offset. Yeah, so uh, I think that's good. And then you can take that out. You want to export your file as an OGG. That's what MediaMap likes to use. And then I just name it whatever I like. Uh, quick access, bit saber. Work in progress, new test song, got me like. Let's just go back in here and bada bing bada boom you're good to go no jump speed we can leave that at 12 spawn distance modifier i don't know what that does i think you're ready so apply modifications now you have your level up here and you can jump into editing take two And then let's put down some notes. I'm pretty sure this is wrong. It looks like it's horribly wrong. Oh boy, that is disgusting. You know why? You know what we didn't do? You know what we didn't do, folks? We didn't put the right BPM in. 116, that's where your BPM goes. Apply modification, save song info, I don't know. Just click all the buttons and edit level. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what? That looks good to me. What you want to do is make your song, press one for red, and then you can use WASDA. So W is up, A is across, D is that way, W, A goes like that, yada, yada, yada. And then if you want a center one, you press F for a dot note. How beautiful. Can you do the same thing with the other, with the two? That looks good, that looks good. That looks good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then press three for bombs. Everybody loves bombs. And then press four for a wall. So you'll click the first time and then you'll drag it to however far you want and click the second time. It will not press five to delete something when you click it. So I have hit five and I click it to delete. You can't draw to the left. You can only draw walls to the right. Okay, okay people. Okay, people. Cool. Um, yeah, that's that's kind of that's all the stuff you need to start mapping. And you've put in, you know, you've put in all your lighting, and you've you've done all that crap all the way. Ooh, that's fun. Strobe. Uh, so save your map. It looks good to go. Okay. So what we want to do now is we want to get your new test song into Beat Saber so that you can play tests and then also. Um, you can export and upload from there. So what we'll do is you'll get Mod Assistant. I'll give you this link below. Uh, that's your .exe. So go ahead and download that, install it, and then you should be able to pull it up, Mod Assistant. And then what you want to do is make sure, oh, you can't unclick it. Fantastic. So choose whatever ones you want. Songcore is already checked. You install or update, and that will create finished installing mods. Okay, in your folder, 
you'll have a songconverter.exe. So what you want to do, you head to your work in progress songs, take out the auto saves folder that should be in there. Uh, I went ahead and deleted that previously. Go ahead and copy that, drop it into your main Beat Saber song folder. So what you want to do here is drag it onto songconverter.exe and it now converts all of the files so that Beat Saber can read it. Be careful though, I don't know how to undo it, but I think somebody in the Discord might if you want some help. My advice, make a copy. Take your new test song, head up to Beat Saber Data, custom work in progress levels, and just plop that bad boy in there. Boom. And then, when we boot up Beat Saber, let's go ahead and do that. Bing! Ba -da 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 -boot. Cool. So once you get into here, you go into solo and you pull up your work in progress maps, songs, there's one song, the song by the artist. You know what? And that's that. So we can go ahead and quit out of, quit out of Boot Saber. <sighs> okay, so after putting it into Beat Saber, play testing, editing, putting it back into Beat Saber, yada, yada, yada. Now you're ready to upload. You'll, what you wanna do is you wanna take your uh, all the items and you want to zip it into a new .zip file. Okay, and so we go over to beatsaver.com and you want to upload a map you can do it here this is a test testing only uh, choose your file beat saver data custom work in progress there it is look at that beauty and upload agreement read all that take notes and then hit ok and look at that there you go uh, let me delete this before anybody plays it. Cool. That's that. You've uploaded your song for the world to critique like the evil villains that they are. Hope you guys enjoy. If you have any questions, don't ask me. Go to the Beat Saber modding group. I will put a link here in the description below. You guys have fun. Bye.